All right, kids, I'm going to get you started on 842, question 88. Uh, there's a part C on the back side, but I'll leave that for you. All right, so the first thing we're going to do, is it's talking about a goalie eating half of a 20-inch pizza. Trust me, a 20-inch pizza, pizza is huge, so the girl must be hungry, right? Half of that pizza? Anyhow, we're going to need a couple formulas. So the area of a circle is A equals pi r squared. You have to know that inside and out. And the circumference of a circle is c equals 2 pi r. SCT will give you both those formulas. Actually, they'll also give you or c equals pi d. Well, you know, obviously diameter is twice the radius, but why memorize two formulas when uh, one of them will do. So I'm just going to erase that. I grew up with 2 pi r, but you get the idea. All right, so let's get started. Well, I think uh, let's, the first thing I would do is, well, the first thing I'm going to do is kind of expand my space here. Give me a little room to maneuver. Okay, now let's just draw the pizza. Okay, not bad. Diameter of 20 inches. You get the idea, okay? So, the, as soon as I hear the area of a circle, I write down the formula. A equals pi r squared. A equals pi, what's the radius? 10, if the diameter is 20, radius is half. You already know that. A equals a hundo pi inches squared. Well, that's the whole pizza. How much did she eat? Well, let's divide that puppy by two. She ate 50 pi inches squared okay and if you watch my previous video you now know pi and where it came from is 3.14159 you have the uh, button on your calculator if you wanted to round this answer okay well it also wants the circumference so let's uh check this out i, I got this is a new little move i'm going to give myself some space to work and we're going to cut that and it's magic okay so if we want to know the crust, how much crust she ate, that's the circumference, okay? Eh, I probably shouldn't erase the circle. Oh, well, no problem. So we want to know half, we want to know this crust right there. Well, that's circumference, so C equals 2 pi r. C equals 2, the radius is 10. And I know some of you are thinking, well, starting well, just use pi d, and you could have done it. That's fine, you can do that. But again, she only had half the pizza, so she only had half the crust divided by 2. She ate 10 pi inches, and circumference is inches, not squared, because it's not area. So there's your answer. Now, in Part B, let me zoom up a little. Okay, Part B, it's talking about there's a different pizza, so let's draw a pizza. I'll do black this time. Oh, is that going to bother you? It's coming in there. That shouldn't make a difference. The radius is 16. Okay, so a little smaller pizza. And 845 degrees worth. So if this is... I'm cutting... I'm See, what I'm doing is I'm doing... Well, that's about 90. So that's about 45 degrees. And that's how much pizza she ate. So let me see if I could highlight I wonder if I could do that. Uh, that's not bad. It's not great, but... Okay, so how much area is that? Well, A equals pi r squared. A equals pi. The radius is 8, right? So the area of the pizza is 64 pi inches squared. But that's the entire pizza. We only want, four, we only want this much of it. So how much of it is it? Well, 45 over Three, why does it do that? 45 over 360, that would be the fractional part of the pizza. So if you multiply that by 64 pi, what happens? Well, I happen to know, you could put this all in the calculator if you want, but 45 goes in once, goes in eight times. It's one eighth of the pizza. And then check this out, eight goes in once, goes in eight times. So when you multiply that across, eight pi inches squared worth of pizza. Well, how much crust are we talking about? Well, maybe I could zoom up a little. Oh yeah, fancy. 
So now we're talking about crust. Let me use a different color. C equals 2 pi r because the crust is the circumference. C equals 2 pi. The radius again was 8. C equals 16 pi. That's the entire crust. But remember how much? we got to multiply that by 45 over 360. Well, we remember that is 1 eighth. And then watch what happens. C equals, because 8 goes in once, twice, she ate 2 pi inches worth of pizza. Hope that helps. Take a break.